seated if you would thank you so much for coming and being a part of worship here at hillview today if you are visiting with us for the very first time you are our guest we've got a packet of information that we want to give you that tells you a little bit about our church there's a, a card you can fill out and turn in the offering bag when it comes around in just a minute so if this is your very first time here 
If you don't mind, just raise your hand. Let us bring that to you. Anybody here for the very first time today? Looking around. Anybody? Very first time. Help us out, church. Anybody? Very first time. Oh, right back here. Awesome. If you don't mind, make them feel welcome today. All right. A couple of other things. If you received a bulletin today, uh, there is a freshman move-in that we help with every year at Western, put on by Hillview. And uh, so if you can help with that, there's a card in your bulletin that you can fill out some info. And you can also turn that into the offering bag if you'd like. We'll get a hold of that so we can contact you. If you have helped with that before, would you please raise your hand? I just want to see who all's in here has helped before. Yeah, several people have helped with that. So uh, we, we need so much help with that. So if you could help with the Western move-in, it is, when is that? It's in the bulletin, she says. It's the weekend before the 22nd. She works with the, what does it say again? Thank you. 13th and 14th. Thank you very much. Audience participation is always good. So thank you for that. Really quick, also Pastor Steve is doing so well. He's making leaps and bounds every day. And so just continue to pray for him that he will be back with us soon. It will not be today. I've had two or three people say, are we going to see, see Steve today? And I'm like, no, no, you won't see Steve today. But, um, but just continue to pray for him and Elizabeth uh, for his continued healing. Also, the communion stations are set up in the back and in the balcony. If you would like to make that part of your worship experience, you are free to do that during these next songs of worship. And so if you don't mind, let's stand together again. We're just going to continue to sing to his name. And so let's just worship him, our worthy God. Let's sing together.
the life you gave Your body was broken Your love poured out You bled and you died for me There on the cross You breathed at last as you were crucified You gave it all for me Hallelujah, what a Savior Hallelujah, what a friend Hallelujah, King forever We thank you for the cross seated if you would. Let's bow our heads. We're going to pray for a time of offering. So let's do that together.
Father, thank you for the gift in Jesus who offered his life one time as a ransom for many. And the book of Hebrews tells us that he died once for all. There's no other sacrifice needed, no other work needed to have a relationship with our Heavenly Father. That Jesus paid the price for all of us to wash our sins clean forever by the shedding of his blood on a cross. Lord, we're so thankful for that. As we continue in worship today, Lord, this time of giving, this time of offering, this, uh, this time of sacrifice for us, Lord, let us worship you and praise you in this time through giving. May you be glorified, our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Thank you, thank you, thank you for what you've done. Thank you for the cross. In Jesus' name, we worship Amen. There is a truth older than the ages. There's a promise of things yet to come. There is one born for our salvation, Jesus. There's a light that overwhelms the darkness. There's a king that forever reigns. There is freedom from the chains that Who stands in? 
There is no one like you, Jesus. There is no one like you, 